hi guys welcome back to another video so in this video i'm gonna be showing you how i organize things when i'm stuck in a barrel for my family what i do first is i try to buy the things that i know that i'm gonna stock first like in the bottom of the barrel i don't start with food because i don't normally put food at the bottom i normally put them at the top so here i have two sisters and they're twins so i tend to buy the same kind of stuff but different sizes this is for my nephew and that's for my mother this one is my brother this one is for another brother my father another brother for my eldest niece and this one right here is also my niece but she has a smaller sister so i just copy what i bought for her and buy something for her but in a smaller size also i always buy things for washing clothes because they do wash a lot so i never leave laundry detergent whenever i'm stuck in a barrel never these are just some little things that my sisters asked for so i just bought them and what you see here i bought them from walmart dollar tree tj maxx and uh, burlington so everything included here are from those stores and then for my niece and never just bought some little books and toys i always buy soap some from walmart some from dollar tree and i bought this one from tj max 7.99 goat milk and soya bean oil soap bought some hair grease always 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 toothpaste always i bought some little candles air freshener mouthwash hair gel from dollar tree all these are lotions some from walmart some from dollar tree and i bought this one from tj max always like to send these as well because as i said they wash a lot these are um deodorants i bought all of these from the dollar tree these are body wash but i bought this from tj maxx as well as this one the perfume body wash and the rest from dollar tree and those are shampoo and conditioner so basically i bought everybody a slide or a slippers so each person has at least one shoes one slipper and a pair of socks and up here so these clothing items are from walmart and tj maxx and also burlington so this is for my nephew and these um little glasses i bought from the dollar tree as well so they're not expensive and this is for my niece and her sister that's for my two sisters it's for one of my brother this is for another brother another brother this is for my father mother and my eldest niece bought these from um tj maxx and these were already wrapped i bought them from um tj maxx as well now this light my mother requested this light so i bought this at walmart and it was 19 dollars something so i went to tj maxx to finish by the rest of clothing that i need just to complete everybody's list right here because my niece she has like pants and shorts this one has the same thing pants and shorts so i forgot to buy them like shorts the last time i sent barrel i sent like two toy cars and my smaller niece got it and i gave the other one to her sister being that two of them you know so my nephew never got any so i saw this and i said you know what let me just make up for that so i bought this for him and it was for 28 dollars so i haven't tried it yet but hopefully it works so basically that is how i plant my barrels so now i'm gonna have to tape all these things up like the shampoo and all those bottled items
okay guys so this is my preparation process i basically group everything write their names on them and then i'm gonna be able to stock the barrels i basically work from a shopping list i always make a shopping list okay let's see if this works the car actually works with six aa batteries while the remote control works with two 